Now, allostatic load was coined by two researchers at the Rockefeller University, McEwen and Steller. And allostatic load describes the physical wear and tear on your body and mind that occurs from constantly adjusting to life's pressures. If not properly managed, this allostatic load increases over time and spills over into subsequent days, accumulating in our nervous system and building up. So you can think of allostatic load kind of in terms of working out. If you endlessly did bicep curls without giving your bicep adequate time to recover, eventually you'd hit a point where you literally would not be able to lift your water bottle off your desk. And allostatic load works with your nervous system in a similar fashion. So when your allostatic load is high, it implies that your body and brain are in a constant state of adapting to new stress, with your system releasing more stress hormones like cortisol and adrenaline. So to perform at your peak and get into flow, clearing your allostatic load has to happen.